hip blew it. What are you doing? <laughs> hey, what's up everyone? Today we're out here at Fallen Creek Park. Nick and I are gonna shoot 18 under. Well, we're gonna see how many mulligans it takes to shoot 18 under. I know this video has been done before, but I think it's a lot of fun and we're gonna play the shorts on this one. We've never done it before, so maybe it might be too easy, but maybe not. So let's get going. So it. So the spike hazard. Move out of the way, please. Go. It's flattening out. Should kind of swing. Yeah, you're good. Oh, in the circle. Alright, cool. We'll take it. First, first birdie. Woo. Okay. There you go. <laughs> no mulligans so far. No, no mulligans mulligan so far. So this hole is a very in-betweener. Are you gonna play it as a par four? It is a par four, yeah. It says par four on the it's T side, so that's how we're gonna play it. Is that the new towel? Yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> dope discs, the proto dope. <gasps> Did you take any of them with Dog you? Dog cam. No? no, I didn't know. Dog cam. Nice. That should be parked or a little deep. Oh, it's a birdie. Here. Okay, so here's Paul's drive on this uh, incredible par, par four. Par four. <laughs> Eagle! Like Hole number three, 285 feet, par three. Off to the left, go with the ESP Malta. Good for me. I'll take my chance on that putt. I'm going with the DGPT. Haley King Stalker, Swirly ESP. Check them out at foundationdisc.com. Probably sold out by the time this is. Probably. Oh, I perfect shot. That. Wow. A little long, but. Packed it. Packed. That. Should've had your Wheaties. Yeah, a lot shorter than I thought. Slick That's pad. <laughs> Should've known. It's still a putt. One dead. out of one. One out Ooh. of one. Dead <laughs> center. Oh, you know, just one for one with the new stalkers. Shout out <laughs> Haley King. Hole number four, 400 feet, par four. I'm gonna go with my sparkle vulture on the first shot. Uh, I feel kind of bad that these are par fours, but I think there's only four of them, so we'll see how it goes from here on out. <laughs> Fight. Uh-oh. Fight. Stay up, stay up, stay up. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, just kidding. That was good. Whoa, I believed in you the whole time. Test play Onyx. Actually took it from Paul a few months ago. He gave it to me. I ain't turn it. Uh-oh. Dang it. Uh-oh. Just be down there, though. Huh? It's a par four. Yeah, that's what I mean. So, yeah, we're taking it. <laughs> Why would we not? <laughs> Got him! Let me clear let me clear this out for you, Paul. Oh boy. <gasps> oh got it! Boom. Still it's outside can't, the circle, right? Still can't even gain a stroke. I was huh? gonna I was gonna fall over, but I held I held. Wow, those was, glutes. Outside. So I think we consider that a par three. Yeah, I mean I had Nick make a couple putts back there on the second hole just in case like there was a trend of these par fours because we didn't look at what the par fours were earlier uh -huh. yeah so he had three he took he took another two putts after and eventually made it yeah. but we didn't film it because i was already like hey you should do this yeah. um so nick's at nick so we'll, 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 we'll edit in there nick's at two mulligans yeah i'm at zero still we looked at the scorecard holes what is it 16 and 16 and 17 are actually par fours they are legit par fours, so we're gonna play those as par fours, but the other two we deemed as par threes. So Nick's at two mulligans, I still have zero. Now we're on hole five, 240 feet. 
straight ahead. But there is some trouble if you hit one of those early trees that you can get a little contenders on your putt. So um, I'm gonna let you go first on this one, Nick. Cool. I'm gonna go with the 2020 Tour Series Luna. Brag. This, you know, really nice one that I got in July. And go get yours at some retailer that has them. <laughs> <laughs> Nick went with the Luna. I'm going with the Impact. Wow. Just shows how he Okay, wait, it. I have a question. What? Speaking of the Impact, a lot of people have been questioning the flight characteristics. In your opinion, how does the Impact fly? Because Shh. some of them are saying they're super stable and other people are saying it's perfect for a hyzer flip. It is a hyzer flip. I'm noticing, uh, like with my buzzes, I can't really hyzer flip them because mm -hmm. they're so neutral. Whatever angle I put it on, it wants to fly like, fly like that. This, I can actually hyzer flip to flat. Um, so it's kind of fun in the woods or if I have close trees, I can trust this on starting at this angle and getting it to flat, so. And I hyzered it. But it's in the circle. Oh, I got a really nice little skip. Though. These pads. I totally did that thing where I ask you how your disc flies before you throw, and you hate. Yeah, because then you I throw hate it that. Let me throw another. Whoops. Impact. I'm throwing that one. <laughs> I'm throwing that one. Oh, this one I'm gonna just do a shorter run up so I don't slip. That would have been pretty cool. Just dead straight. Like, <laughs> don't take a deep bad. breath before you put that. I was just getting ready. Oh boy, bag on, rookie move. Get this guy out of here. So we're in hole six now. Uh, Paul and I both parked the last hole. This one's just a little forehand, about 260 feet. I'm going with the Raptor and I'm sure Paul's going with the Force. Oh, get in the basket. Oh. I'm Nick Carl and welcome to <laughs> Welcome to Jack. <laughs> <laughs> so I had a random bystander yell in my backswing. I ended up a little bit short. But that's alright. Because in these kind of moments we clutch up. Oh my gosh. Who's we? Nick Carl! I hate that you just made that. <laughs> I hate that. Wait, so how do Luna how do Luna's fly? <laughs> <laughs> when did you become a hyzer putter? Huh? Oh. <laughs> well. Well. Hole seven. 250 feet, par three. Uh, two options, backhand or forehand. I'm going with the Crystal Luna, the ESPN2 version. Ooh. Let's not choke this shot, right? Like that. I think I'm gonna take my chances on that putt. Really? I'm gonna go the opposite route. I'm gonna get freaky and go with the forehand. Nick can make a big putt, so. Get out. <laughs> get out. <laughs> you got it in my head. <laughs> that was so rude. I might actually have to use Mulligan right here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. Oh, now I got a simmer. That's fine. Can you tell us how far this is? <laughs> uh, close to 50. We have to yell because there's a plane. It's about close to 50. I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> Go. Oh. Ooh, first mulligan. First mulligan. Same thing twice. Get up. High enough. Yeah. There you go. That's not what I wanted. Actually, he's at four. I heard you say he's about to be at four. No, you're at four. You took three mulligans to putt on hole two. Whoa! Hole eight. 245 feet. Don't even think it's that far. I'm going with the Luna, just straight at it. I'm trying to get it ace. And I buried it. But I'm gonna put it. Four hands down. Just because this pad's so slick. Dunk it. Oh 
Oh no. OB. Yes. The creek actually goes over there. It looks like there's an old house here. There's a bunch of bricks. It's a good piece of land. <laughs> All right, this is Paul McBeth for Birdie from, looks like Circle's Edge a little bit. Oh. Oh, great putt. Wow. In Massachusetts, that plot of land right there, it's 250 grand. Oh. And Nick Carl gets his birdie! And, and birdie! Nick, Nick Carl's birdie. disc right here is a fierce that he wanted to really throw because he didn't get a chance. 991 Aww. crystal fierce. No, signed. ESP. ESP. Oh, ESP. What I, oh, ESP swirl. ESP swirl. It's signed. signed. It's funny, I didn't even it's ask signed. to get it signed and they signed it in. <laughs> I think she signed all of them. Yeah. No. We're on hole nine. Uh, it's 199 feet. Uh, I'm gonna go with my swirly ESP fierce. Oh, I turned that. It's probably putting from like 25. Okay, Nick Carl, not in an ideal position. This is gonna be tough. I can't go wider. Obviously. Literally can't. Or just one. Oh! Oof. Oh no! Do you want me to sing the Halo theme song? I knew that's all it needed. I literally knew it. Nick, I'm kind of confident in this one. Get this little big thing, Charlie Brown. Oh, redirected. He's just playing a horse at this point. That looks better. That's not bad. <gasps>